The Swiss economist Klaus Wellershoff has published a really, really interesting book. He makes a very strong case that the interest rates are historically low. And he concludes that the returns on the stock markets will not be that excellent. What does it mean for me? I have stocks, you know, I have a couple of portfolios. What could I do to hedge this risk? And my decision was to go more into gold stocks. What I did is I downloaded the Obermott database, which you get with every Obermott email, every weekly Obermott email, and I filtered for the gold stocks. What you see here is Centamine, Polius, Rungold, and then Gold Fields, the next investable company, Invest in Markets. These are the companies I looked at. If you look at Centamine, and what I have here is the interface of my broker, it's a company in Australia. Well, I looked at the recommendations and it looks that they have really good recommendations. I looked at Obermott stock ranks and I realized, realized their value rank is actually quite mediocre. Well, I went on to look for more companies. I looked at Polius. Well, Polius is a Russian company. That's quite a stretch. When you look at the value rank at Obermott, it's 73. So that's really good. You get a lot of value for the price, but then you have to invest in Russia. And this is not really what I want to do right now. I want to invest in Western markets. Rangold is on the London Stock Exchange. It's uh, based in um, West and Central Africa. Sounds pretty good to me already. Rangold is interesting. I look at the ranks and unfortunately their value rank is bad. Their safety rank is high, but what does that help me? Well, the recommendations on, uh, on my stock broker are actually quite good. So Rangold could be an option, but I have decided to look on further for other companies. And the next company I looked at was actually listed on a US stock exchange and it's called Goldfields. Well, Goldfields looks like they have more hold ratings uh, in my stock broker. I looked at our ranks and they actually have a really good value rank. Now, I really like that. I also like the fact that they are in South Africa. I went to their website and found a really funny picture of how such a gold mine looks. I always had a complete different picture of that. Well, I looked at the website and I found that they're based in Johannesburg, but only have a few people there at the headquarters. Most people, of course, work in the mines. They're also globally diversified. I like that. I also went to see at their leadership. I went through a few pages and what you see here is their executive management. And I had a really good impression. These people looked trustworthy, the financial numbers look good and it's a gold mine. I want to invest in gold mines. So this was my decision to invest the first money in gold fields of my portfolio that should be exclusively gold stocks. This was my investment. I wish you good luck with your investment.